Hello adventurers. So wanted to give you a tour here of a beautiful hotel in Barcelona. It is called Mariano Cubi Apart Hotel. So it's kind of like more of a hotel with an apartment style that's kind of popular here in Europe, especially for families like us that's more than two guests. We're going to have four people, so we need space to sleep. So remember, in Europe, hotels are very different than in the States, so it's something to keep in mind when you're planning your adventure uh, as far as location and how much can I put into room and things like that. Again, this is more of an apartment style hotel. Very lovely. I highly recommend it. We've had a great stay here in Barcelona. Everybody's been super accommodating. The staff is fantastic. They're super helpful, especially because there you know, can be a little bit of a language barrier and just helpful in getting around the beautiful city that they also live in and enjoy. So I wanted to show you what we stayed in. This is kind of the area when you walk in they do have like a small kitchenette area. You will have to call down to guest services downstairs to let them know if you want to use this. We are not sure if this is actually complimentary or not. We didn't use it because they have a breakfast that you can add to your package before you come or you can pay once you arrive on site. It's a, it's a buffet style breakfast, so pastries and fruits and coffees and things like that, juices. It's, it's good. It's a nice little breakfast or there are plenty of places really close by to walk to. So that's something we'll talk about in the video too maybe. Uh, when you enter in, you're going to use a key card. They will give you your um, room key and this is to turn on the lights. Uh, they are very eco-friendly here so they're trying to watch how much water they use and the lights uses as well so they're being smart. Over here they do have a little desk. You'll see like a little mini bar if you will um it is not complimentary so they clearly labeled that on here which is why i'm not sure if the other one is either then if you come in here you'll actually sleeps for guests we've got a pull out sofa which they had made for us we didn't have to do any of that that was already made towels were on the bed for the kids then we had like a little sleeper chair right here so that's the one two and then over here we have the three four which is like a king style bed I, you might can actually divide this if you had, you know, a, a group of four friends maybe traveling together. So that was nice. Over here, we do have a little closet. Just, you know, enough. And then they have the safe, which is nice. And then inside here, this is the bathroom. Take a quick peek if you want to. Um, it's a pretty good size. I mean, it's got the, it's got a full shower. The toilet, of course, and, you know, the mirror. And then it's got a towel warmer. They may replace the towels if you're here for many days. Again, we just kind of reused um, the towels as we needed to because we didn't need anybody to come in and clean for the few days we were here. Um, over here, it will say... Remember, not all places are air conditioned in Europe, so that's super important to keep in mind when you're traveling in, in hot seasons. This hotel is air conditioned and is heated. However, depending on when you're here. So we're here in May, for example, they have not yet turned on the air condition. So if I turn on my unit right now, I'm going to get heat. So they were really gracious and did tell us that. However, we have this great window here that you can open. Oh, mm -hmm. dogs are super popular here in Barcelona, but this is a great little view out here. It does kind of keep the warm, the room a little bit cooler. Let's see the street view. We'll check out the patio over here too. They have these little um, window uh, openers, these shades. So this one is going to, oh, wrong way. It's going to open this one up for us. So you'll see. There we go. Oh, flow. <laughs> but a great view. So real quick while I'm thinking about it, where we are centrally located is a great, it's a great area. We're about 15 minutes from um, all different kinds of things. We're 15 minutes, about 15, 20 minutes from the port, from the cruise port. So if you're cruising out, or we're also really close to a metro train station. So we did get to experience that. It was super easy. It was a quick little walk right down the road. We got our tickets and we were able to go on. La Ramba was like, what, maybe 20, 30 minutes maybe? It was a quick little train ride over, super easy to navigate. Same thing when we went to uh, visit, um, San, um, oh my goodness, I'm gonna say it wrong. Um, La Familia Sangrada. When we went to go visit that, we were able just kind of to bus over. And it was maybe like a, I think we could have walked to that actually. A little bit of a walk, but you could have. It's about a 30 minute walk. So you could just take a bus or metro. And then out here, it's kind of just a nice little cute little patio. It's kind of tight, but it's 
it's cute. It's fun. Again, you're kind of getting to experience that environment of being in Barcelona, being in the city, and being experiencing the culture is the big thing. Well, thanks for joining me on this great tour this video. Maybe you, if you have any questions or want some answers on Barcelona, visiting the city, or enjoying this nice hotel, be happy to help you guys out. Again, I definitely recommend it. It's been beautiful. We've had a great stay here. So thank you so much to the city of Barcelona for letting us enjoy all your things that you have to offer. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.